With good news for today from Baptist Press, I'm Brandon Porter. As we look back on 2022, we're remembering some of our favorite stories. Southwestern Baptist Theological Seminary student Meng Singh recently became part of history when he served as the narrator for the Zoe language translation of the world-famous Jesus film. The effort marked the 2000th available language for the film. The story Jesus depicts the life and ministry of Christ and is the world's most translated film according to the Guinness Book of World Records. Since its release in 1979, it's been viewed by billions of people around the world and it's resulted in more than 600 million decisions for Christ. That's according to the statistics on the film's website. Singh, who is pursuing a PhD in missions with a minor in evangelism at the seminary, was approached through a connection with the evangelical organization Crew about leading the translation project for the film in the Zo language. Singh, who is from Myanmar, said Zo is one of 50 different dialects of the Chin people group and was the last of the Chin languages to receive a Bible translation. The New Testament translation of Zo was completed about 10 years ago, followed by the entire Bible in 2018. Aside from the Bible and a few Christian hymns, Singh says there is a lack of Christian content or resources in Zo since many tribes do not have access to the internet. Good news for today is made possible through our friends at The Voice of the Martyrs, a nonprofit organization that serves persecuted Christians around the world. Founded in 1967 by Richard and Sabina Wormbrand, VOM is dedicated to inspiring believers to deepen their commitment to Christ and to fulfill His great commission, no matter the cost. Find out more and sign up for their free monthly magazine at vom.org slash good news. At one point this year, Herndon Hooker was the frontrunner for the Heisman Trophy in college football. The star at the University of Tennessee also thought it would be nice to write a children's book. Football has always been a part of his family. His father, Allen, was an All-American at North Carolina A&T in the 80s, and he still holds many school records there, including throwing for six touchdowns in one game. Alston, Herndon's brother, is also a freshman at his father's alma mater, while Herndon himself is in his second season with Tennessee. The result of their work together was the ABCs of Scripture for Athletes. It was written in a comic book format, and it's available at hookedonsports.org. When the name, image, and licensing deal became a reality for college athletes last year to earn money, the brothers looked to one another and knew this was the idea that they wanted to utilize moving forward. For Herndon and Alston, it led them to the days of learning scripture from their parents and how they could share that with others.